Hello my viewers. Today I'd like to talk about ESCO Institute and the many certifications that they offer. Uh, I have the ESCO card which is you know the ESCO Institute certification for the EPA section 608 and actually until recently I didn't even know that they offered anything other than the 608 and the 609 certifications. Uh, they offer many more certifications than that. Actually I think it's maybe about 10 or so. So uh, let's take a look at a couple of them that I have some DVDs for. Now here's what I got. I got a ESCO Institute 2009 HVACR catalog and I have the HVAC Excellence uh, Trainers catalog right here. Okay. Also now here's the goods what we're talking about. We have two DVDs that are jam-packed full of valuable information. First one is basic refrigeration and charging procedures. Let's take a look at that one. We'll just go ahead and plop this into the DVD player in my computer. Alright, and then here momentarily, it'll come up automatically. Take note, <laughs> this requires um, a Mac or Windows, and sorry Linux users, I'm kind of a Linux user myself. Um, oh, this is the only Windows computer that I have. The other four are all Linux. So anyway, this one is Windows 7 and of course it's going to play very well on Windows 7. And here we go. Uh, just go ahead here and click to run that. Welcome to Basic Refrigeration we go. and Charging Procedures. This, this is the intro. Will cover many we'll go ahead and skip the intro for right now. And let's see here. You see right here where you have the main categories. And if you click on the main categories, well first let's go through the main categories. It's refrigeration system, the refrigerant properties, subcooling and superheating, metering devices, system charging. So we'll click on the refrigeration system and then of course no. And then another a window pops up, or air and we'll by stop that right there. And it has some pretty cool graphics to go along with the uh, lesson. And the main categories are all subdivided into like sub uh, lessons. You got on, on, for example, a refrigeration system is uh, comprised of the about the compressor. Discharge line, condenser, receiver, liquid line, metering device, evaporator, and suction line. And then you have other the other categories on this one. Um, like we'll, we'll click on the refrigerant properties. The typical vapor compression oh, refrigeration system. Okay. Uh, now, at the end of uh, the rest of these main categories is a section quiz. It's ten questions long. And each of these other uh, categories has uh, a section quiz at the very end. This is just jam-packed full of valuable information, whether you're new to the trade or you've, you're a master at the trade. Now let's take a look at the Universal R410A Safety and Training DVD. All right, we'll go ahead and plug that in the DVD player. And it'll come up here shortly. Click on uh, that box and and here we go. You have an intro on this one as well. It's widely accepted the okay. based refrigerant. So, here we are. Okay. This DVD is divided into uh, six 
parts really sort of it's uh, the background which kind of tells you about what global warming is and the Montreal Protocol and then you have the systems fundamentals refrigerant chemistry refrigerant oil safety and then at the very end you have a 25 question practice exam which is to prepare you for the main uh, final exam uh, so you can get your certification now let's see let's try this we'll hit background okay R410A is a binary or two-part near azeotropic mixture and is presently marketed under the brand names of yep. Genitron AZ20, yep. Puron, or Suva. It is okay, so see it's this one too has some pretty nice graphics to it and it is too full, jam-packed full of information. And at the end of uh, this one, at the very end of each main category, you have a practice test. Uh, five question practice test. Uh, so that's uh, five questions on the background, five questions for the systems, fundamentals, and so forth. And then like I said you have a 25 question exam, practice exam anyway, uh, at the very end covering the entire DVD. And this is to prepare you for the exam. Let's take a better look at this uh, ESCO Institute 2009 HVAC or catalog. Um, it of course tells you what all other certifications you can get through them. Uh, one is the probably the most popular, the EPA uh, Section 608 program. Um, and uh, let's see. And there's the. EPA Section 609 program. Of course, that's for you people who work on automotive air conditioning. And then you have another uh, certification here of R410A program. And let's see, then there's the Green Awareness program, the HVACR electrical program. refrigeration charging procedures program heat pump program uh, system diagnostics and troubleshooting program the combustion analysis and fuel efficiency program the carbon monoxide and building pressures program the medium and high efficiency gas furnace program and they have lots of other training resources yeah, lots of books right here that you can get and uh, here's your order form so you can buy the things that they show you in the, in the catalog Okay, you may be asking yourself now, uh, how can I look up ESCO Institute on the internet so I can buy these DVDs? Well, it's real easy. All you have to do is go to escoinst.com. Right there's the URL. And thank you.